let me let me get into my persona. Hi, Slay Nation. <laughs> Hi, Slay Nation. What's up? How are we today? I'm with the, the fam. We're thrifting. Come thrift with me. Okay. First stop of the day was Savers, of course. And Savers is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get, but what you get a lot of the time is just straight up poop. So we got to the interesting finds right off the bat. I think I, think I need this. It's $12. No. My question <laughs> is why, how, what, when, where? And it's forgetification because the theory is a black hole stretch you out. Oh. Your individual particles. I thought it was just talking about spaghetti. Me too. No, it was talking about the effect the black hole would have on matter. Okay. Well, you know, that makes more sense. I spent 15 minutes looking cool and mysterious throughout the store and trying not to make a joke about Queen Elizabeth's passing. Um, <laughs> rip in peace. Anyways, I was scared that I wouldn't find anything, but psych, do you know who I am? Of course I found stuff, so let's get into it. So first there was this lace dress that I thought would be like really cute and chic and stuff. But then I realized someone probably had intercourse in that. And I had touched that. That's besides the point though. Uh, enter cool trying on montage here. Bam, flannel time. I needed flannel, so I got flannel. This first flannel is emo flannel. Uh, this is because I look like I would steal your lunch money. Don't tell me otherwise. And this is happy flannel where I would take you out for a picnic. See the difference? Emo flannel, yeah, cool swag. Happy flannel, ah, uh, pretty sweet. There we go. So next we got the sweaters. We have this like knit sweater from like 1985 type of vibe. It's awesome. I look like I could be in a coming of age movie. I actually love it. Um, throughout these outfits like that I try on, I definitely could have changed my jeans and the things I paired with them, but uh, simple to put, I was too lazy. Next we have this Christmas sweater, definitely handmade, has no tag. Like I could be a grandpa at your local ugly sweater Christmas party and I don't care. I, it's what I'm living for. It's what I live for. Anyways, that's like all I got from this store and we checked out. That feeling when you don't have to. That feeling when you don't have to talk to people. Um, oh, wait. You can open it. Open, <laughs> open it, it and film. <laughs> what the f? What? No, there's no explanation for that. You're right, I'm not explaining here. Next shop, Play-Dohs, yay. Okay, I've said it once, I'll say it again. Play-Dohs is off-brand, not really thrifting, thrifting. Um, like basically, everything's really expensive there or Shein, and it's just not worth it. Except sometimes you find this. What? Yeah, I was basically in a state of shock there. Okay, first off, there's a lot going on now. Second off, why is that why is that my subtitle font? Should I get it just because of that? I just I will always be so happy that the years of 2016 and I'm a potato, a little awkward like a banana is over because I can't I can't do that anymore. Nope nobody should have been doing it in the first place. But everything here is expensive and not that cute. Oh, oh I thought there was a topless mannequin that was about to be like oh but no, no, it has a shirt on. We walked around the store for like 15 minutes and because I'm desperate and a slave to capitalism, I bought two things. So I got this like chiller toned down button up that I've been wanting because I've just like, a lot of my button ups are really bright colored and this one isn't and it's just cute. And yes, I know I'm pairing it with the same stuff that I've been pairing it for the whole time. I'm too lazy to change. Anyway, next I got this sweatshirt, human and kind, so aesthetic, right? Um, yeah, cute, but what? What? What is the point of that? Why? Why? I don't know. It's just, it's just like a slit dress, I guess. Anyway, the, the sweater's still comfy. I'm just confused by it. My whole body's okay. in pain. I'm starving. Let's go to Chuck E. Cheese. Chuck E. Cheese. Mm -hmm. Chuck, Chuck, Charles Entertainment Cheese. <laughs> Unfortunately, yet again, we did not go to Chuck E. Cheese, which just breaks my heart, but we did get something better. Oh my gosh, Panda Express. I love Panda Express. Panda Express is the best thing to ever exist. It puts me in physical pain. It is so good. Yeah, no, I... I ate a lot of that Panda Express. <laughs> but we had gotten done with, like, all the thrifting spots near us, so it's like, what do we do next? We could go home. We should have gone home. But no. There was a spirit Halloween right next to us, and you think we're gonna pass up this opportunity? Absolutely not. So I went to the scariest place on Earth. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't wanna go in there. Weird. <laughs> Monkey. Monkey. 
I don't want to see this. Step on it. Oh. <laughs> this monkey just barked at me. While we had our fun here, it was just simply too much. It was too much. We didn't have intention of buying anything, and everything was scary, and we just had to get out of there. What is this? Have you seen the um the thing that's like Do you know what I'm talking about? No. No, do you guys want to know why I requested this song? <laughs> How? You guys can imagine that now.